Welcome to First Word Pharma's News Roundup for February 19th, brought to you today by editorial researcher Olivia Roger. In our top news story, the FDA approved AstraZeneca's PDL1 inhibitor, Infinzi, to include the treatment of certain patients of unresectable stage 3 non small cell lung cancer. The company noted that the drug is the only immunotherapy cleared in this indication, which is for patients whose disease has not progressed following concurrent platinum-based chemotherapy and radiation therapy. Dave Fredrickson, head of AstraZeneca's oncology unit, said, Globally, approximately 30% of patients with non-small cell lung cancer present with stage 3 disease, and we are excited to launch the first immunotherapy into this setting. Deutsche Bank analyst Richard Parks remarked, that the FDA approval of Infimsy in lung cancer came around one month earlier than expected. In other news, Eli Lilly halted mid-state trials of the experimental drug HM71224 in patients with rheumatoid arthritis because it is unlikely to meet the primary efficacy endpoint. Partner Han Mi Pharmaceutical noted that the companies are in talks regarding development of the BTK inhibitor in other autoimmune diseases. And finally, a U.S. judge overturned a verdict requiring Gilead Sciences to pay $2.54 billion because its hepatitis C drugs infringed a patent held by Merck & Co. The judge ruled that Merck's patent was invalid, noting that it did not meet a requirement that it discloses how to make the treatment it covered without undue experimentation. To read these and other stories in full, please visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today. 